Hey guys, this is uh, JRWAR23, Warrior Cafe and Cole, and David. <laughs> <laughs> Just David. Alright, and today, um, Colton has only seen two James Bond movies. I've well, seen a few. Okay, well, I've his, seen four. His, his two favorites are Goldeneye and Skyfall, but you know what? He can't pick which one. Neither yeah. can I, but he can. So now, we, what we want you to do now is we want you to explain why you like Skyfall more than Goldeneye. Because these are the two we are debating today. Two of the best James Bond movies out there. Okay, you explain. Well, one reason I think Skyfall is better is just because of the climax, really. It was, in my opinion, better than Goldeneye with the climax. Another, any other reasons? Not many more, except I think Daniel Craig's James Bond has more experience now as James Bond in Skyfall than think, what he did yeah. in the old, than he what showed, he did in the older ones. Yeah, like you know, because he's a lot more. He's able to be more like Bond. You know, yeah. the older ones he was starting out as Bond, and now he has, has become been, Bond. Yeah, and he's proved to be one of the best. I think the it was a bit more fast pace. Yeah, um, but the action though was it was extremely yeah. awesome. Actually, it was. Yeah. It was, I think it had more. I think it had better action did, than in Goldeneye. Yeah, but I think the Goldeneye, soundtrack was a hundred times yes, better. Yes, and it yeah, came out right at the right time. Um. Yes. Exactly. And the plus is celebrating 50 years of Bond, so I can see why you would like it. But now, my turn, right? So you would pick Skyfall. Who said it was your turn? I thought it was Colton's. No, my turn. No, I don't. I don't really have an opinion on this subject. Well, I, yeah, why, I can't then decide. Then why are you even here? I can't decide. Okay. Then why okay. are you here? All right, but well, I'll give my reasoning for liking Goldeneye a little bit more. This is the first James Bond movie I ever saw. It's the movie that got me into James Bond. You know, I started playing the video game. It really got me invested into this universe. And Good for the, you. The stunts. Trying to make this fun. Oh uh, yeah, we're trying to make this fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, the the stunts were great, and the action scenes were awesome. Um, Pierce Brosnan's a really good James Bond. Um, That's what Z you think. Xenia on the top. Yeah, she got. Getting horny. Um, <laughs> not even joking. It's like at the end, she at the end her death. He's like. I think Colton thinks Jim. I think Colton thinks Bond was better than was yeah. hornier than the other person. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at the back. Look at the back cover for gosh sake. And then the front, he's like kissing. This is the better back he's cover kissing, though. He's Skyfall. kissing. He's kissing Natalia and stuff. I don't have a movie to pull. But um, let's move on. Suck to, it up. Let's move on to villains because I think this is a very important part. Silva was like the Joker for James Bond. Let's face it, he basically was. That's what yeah. he was. But also, uh, Sean Bean from The Lord of the Rings that was, was the a villain. Part Alec, Tra Alec Trevelyan was awesome, and he's equal to Bond. He's a physical challenge because he knows every all of Bond's move, yeah. moves. And Oromoth, the other villain who was in the tank chase scene. That was a good scene. That scene was awesome. That was probably my favorite scene it, from Goldeneye. That, that, that was my favorite scene. It was an sure. awesome scene. I've got to agree. I mean, it was so cool. And it was, I mean, Oromoff, the other villain, he was good. Um, Natalia, um, yeah, the chick on the main cover. She, the chick. <laughs> she was... I think she's lesbian. No, she <laughs> made out with Bond. Most, so? most, most illogical, as Spock would say. From Star Trek. Uh, most yes, illogical. but... She, She's an actor. She'd have to play by her role. She she was a good actress. She did a great job in the roles. She was like not the same old damsel in distress. At the end, she didn't get caught. She was like, oh no, James Bond, save me, get to watch a PBK, kill all of them, and oh, save me. Oh, you mean like in Skyfall, how she took oh. the money and got trapped in the elevator? By... Who? Wait, oh. Remember? The elevator. What? Remember at the end when the two, when Bond and... Oh, M. Yeah. Right. No, Bond Which and, uh... Which one did you show me first? Oh, no, that was Casino Royale. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. That was Casino yeah. Royale, sorry. Oh, okay. Goldeneye Another was the good first James one Bond I was movies. showed. Yeah, so we, fo we really? both... We both first saw Goldeneye, so yeah. it's kind of... I was showed it by yeah, him. Yeah, by him. By, 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 by this guy right here that I'm you know, slapping you know, in the back of the head. 
<laughs> Jed, you know, you know, the first James Bond movie you ever guess I watched, you had it right first. What was it again that you said? Um, Casino Royale. No, it was one of the older, older ones. Oh, a Goldfinger. Yes. Goldfinger. Oh, you know, I that love was the Gold first James Bond movie. I, I saw. love Goldfinger. It's got Odd Job, the big Chinese yeah. guy. It's got Gold. It's you are Bill. Oh no. You expect me to talk? No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die! That was, uh, that's that a was great hilarious. line, that was a classic. He hasn't seen Goldfinger yet, no. so too bad for Go you. Go behind a hole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is my cousin you are talking to, joke no. face. I knew you were going to say yeah after I said something, um, so... Anyway, um, <laughs> so, I, you know, I think I like Goldeneye a little bit more because it was the first one I ever saw, but wow, Skyfall is Awesome. It's Skyfall. I nobody's think it was, heard my you know, opinion but, yet. Well, you guys, nobody cares about arguing. your opinion. Yeah, we're arguing. Well, but okay. Jaden, you know, I you, think. But I'm not arguing. I do think that Skyfall is a better straight up action it, movie. But I just, I think Goldeneye was just classic Bond. But and Skyfall? It, okay, if you're going for action, go for Star Trek Into Darkness. De definitely. But uh, if you want to. Go for the Dark Knight Rises, though, too. No! Dark no, Dark Well, I mean, stupid. go for it if you want to see, like... What? You thought the Dark Knight Rises was stupid. Let's gang beat him, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, now it's time to hear Colton's opinion since he just got... Well, to nobody go. cares about his opinion, so I, why should we even let him Let's do it. Speak? Let him just speak, okay? <laughs> Three Stooges action there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For action, Let it, it would be this one, Skyfall. But for epicness, it would definitely be Goldeneye. Oh, Because the dude. giant said, like, dish out of the lake. Oh, that was that awesome. That was epic. More epic than an old mansion. But overall, but, my favorite movie is Star Trek Into Darkness. What? And my favorite TV show is Star Trek The Next Generation. Oh, we are look, you look tricky here. But no, we are... <laughs> Fast Five. Why? They, we're talking about James Bond. I know. Bond. Oh, I know. my favorite movie is Fast Six. What? You like all the new movies. Yeah. My favorite movie is The Empire Strikes Back. That came in uh, 1981. I Empire don't Strikes Back? My, my favorite one, though, I, Star Wars? I'd yeah. have to say, uh, Star Wars is Clone Wars, not the animated, see, not the animated series, but the actual second movie, The Clone Wars, I think was pretty good. Attack of the Clones? Attack of the Clones. That's Clones. my least favorite of the Star Wars movies. <laughs> yeah. That movie sucked. Anyway, back to James Bond, guys. Okay, my personal opinion, it's probably Golden. Um. <laughs> <All right. laughs> hey, look at me, guys. Hey, look at me. Hey, look at me. I'm Colt. I'm Colton. Hey, guys, I'm Colt. <laughs> Perfect impression. Okay, now, what, your favorite Skyfall? And then, what's your, what do you got to pick? You can't decide <laughs> still. No. Just, Out of those two, I, uh, I'd have to go Goldeneye. Okay. So, um, no, wait, let me add one more thing. Casino Royale. I've never seen that I'm one! I'm asking Jaden, not you, Colton. <laughs> I'm asking, out of these three, Casino Royale, Golden um, Eye, or Skyfall, out of those three from James Bond, Probably for you. Casino Royale, because Same. Casino Royale was just a group. It, it was. A, it, it had amazing action, but yeah. it also had heart, you know? Yeah, and it, it also had a little bit of drama, too, <laughs> The that. drama, and it wasn't born because of that, and yeah. I like it, how... The drama had, added to the action. It added to it. It made it have more of an impact, and you saw how Bond became yeah. such a cold-hearted person. I think that, I like how it took more time on his character, but also played a bit like a traditional Bond movie. Yeah. But it was a good movie on its own. You could just watch it, it and be like, oh, it, you feel it, like you're watching Casino Royale more than I'm watching a James Bond movie. It, well, it, it but, incorporated the yeah. old with the new. Yeah, and I like that. It started a new generation of Bond added, movies to follow. It, it added Goldeneye with, like, a Skyfall movie with that. It kind of added both it, of those together. Not really. I, I mean, just, it, it added was, the... It was his own movie. It, did, yeah, it did, wasn't but, like any other Bond I'm, film. It, Jim, Daniel Craig's he did uh, such a good experience job. Experience in that movie yeah. was good, but his was, Skyfall experience was better. But I yeah. still have to go with Casino Royale because, over Skyfall. Because Casino Royale was just so different and, and fresh it, and stylized and great action. Too. Yeah, I mean but, the action. My favorite Bond action scenes actually the African chase. That is good. That was incredible. That was yeah. so cool. But and the, then um. But over. Skyfall and Golden Knight, I would still have to go Skyfall. Casino Royale is probably my favorite Bond film, but I think another one to compete with um, the best Bond films would be From Russia with Love with Sean Connery. 
That was that, just the I, villains were. I like the villains, except I didn't really like Shim Con Sean Connery in there as much. I I think I Sean mean, Connery's the best James he, Bond. Um, I I didn't really like him. I thought he was better in Highlander than he was in the. Uh, well, I thought he was perfect as Bond. He really set the standards for how Bond should be played. The, the, I, uh, I think Goldfinger was another um, one. But Gold another one, is Goldfinger good. was awesome. Yeah. And then uh, The Living Daylights with Timothy Dalton. That was good. I like Timothy Dalton. I really like Timothy Dalton. And I also so like a License to Kill, too. Oh, License to Kill was really violent and epic. Yes. I think um, Timothy Dalton's one of the most underrated actors in Hollywood. He, he is. He did. He is such a great actor. It's, nobody and, really recognizes yeah. him as that. There's... <laughs> I think... I like how he's just sitting there. I, lo I love how we're doing the movie debate and he's and then just... Garbage can? He's like, look at that garbage can. That's a nice garbage can. <laughs> yeah. And then he looks over here. You have a Wii? I don't... You have, you have a Wii and a Wii. I have neither. Shut up! Uh, but uh, let me throw this at you. I didn't like the Final Dimension for the original Highlander series. Oh, no. That one sucked. No. The best Highlander, I think, was the first one. Oh, the original. And uh, I like the TV series of Highlander, too. Oh, with the, yeah. Christopher Duncan. Lambert. Yeah. Oh, really? Duncan McLeod? Yeah. Or I, I mean, no, but that's I like the first the first actual TV series of that said Sean yeah. Connery in there as that. Oh, they did? I, yeah, I'm not did. a big Highlander person, but um, <laughs> I think that uh, Tomorrow Never Dies is the most action-packed oh, James Bond that movie. Was that was pretty good. Stuff. Yeah, what would you think of that one? It was so... I, I saw two that day. I don't remember which one it was. It was The World Is Not Enough, because Tomorrow Never Dies is... World Is Not Enough was one of them, and Tomorrow Never Dies was the other. But what Which you, one did you like better? I don't remember which one was which, though. That's the thing. Which one do you which like one better, was, Oh, definitely Tomorrow Never Dies. Same. That movie was action-packed, excitement. It was really the, fun The other one, watch. though, I... I didn't really like it. Was I, it was kind it kind of ruined the James Bond series for no, some of. Well, no, that was Die it. Another Day. Oh, that yeah. that's with Halle Berry. Oh, that sucked. I actually kind of liked The World Was Not Enough. It had great I mean, David Arnold, the composer he, that came after John. Wow, that is just excellent. He was good, music. but I mean, just the whole um, setting of the James Bond. I think, for that, but I actually think that bad. Tomorrow Never Dies has the best car chase. In that was the best car chase. That and the Living Daylights. Remember the one in the yes. snow and he's, they're on the ice and everything. That yeah, was so cool. That was like the best. Look at that. Stool. <laughs> That's a nice. Stool. No, he's looking at your dog. But... He's like, look at that ass. <laughs> <laughs> Do you All think right. we should wrap it up for now? Yeah, let's wrap it up. You know, or we're else we're going to get too out of hand. <laughs> <laughs> WarriorCatFanCole at gmail.com. Subscribe to me. Don't Yay. subscribe to him. Don't yeah. subscribe. You can subscribe to us both. You can fucking fart in your face. <laughs> <laughs> Get off of me. Get off of me.